Hello there, Leo and Leo Rising. This is gonna be your October love forecast reading for the month of October. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go and cut these cards and we're gonna see exactly what sort of kind of wants to come out. And I'm gonna put them in the in in four quarters. It'll be two for the first quarter, two for the second quarter, two for the third quarter, and two for the fourth quarter. And we're gonna see exactly what wants to come out in terms of your reading and exactly what's gonna go on moving forward. So I'm gonna just keep on cutting these cards here and oh my goodness, two cards have already wanted to come out. We're just gonna just keep on. Keep on coming on here and see what is going on. We actually have actually have two other cards here that want to come out. And let's go ahead and just keep on cutting these cards here. Let's see which other ones want to come out. And actually, I'm actually gonna use these, I'm thinking. Let's go ahead and see what is going on for you guys. Go ahead and see what's going on. So anyway, the first card here is the Five of Coins, saying, honest to goodness, guys, if you guys want it, you guys are going to be able to get it. This is going to be the month where you're really going to be able to have exactly what you want, get exactly where you're wanting to get, and do exactly what you want to do. This is going to be a very, very fantastic month of just being able to really, really start having some things that are going to be able to really go in your favor, but at the same time, you're not really going to have to ask too much for it, because it's just going to be able to really go in the right direction for you. The next card here is a Three of Cups, saying, honest to goodness, you're going to be able to start having fun, start enjoying yourself, and start really being able to experience all the happy, all the happiness and all the fun that really honest to goodness is going on for you. This is going to be a really, really nice situation. It's really going to be able to move you in the direction that you really want to, but at the same time, be able to have, make you have some fun while you're getting there. Excitement, excitement, playtime. It's going to be all about that in terms of this month. And honest to goodness for you, you're going to be able to have a lot more fun than you may actually realize. Next card here is a chariot in reverse, saying honest to you, in terms of the fourth, in terms of the second quarter of the month, you're gonna be able to really sort of kind of get there at your own pace. No rush, and there's gonna be no rush put on you. This is gonna be a time for your relationship to really start feeling very good, because you're really gonna be able to move in that direction, move in a happy way, and just feel really, really great overall. Next card here is the Five of Cups, saying, honest to goodness, you're going to be able to hold on to something, but you're not necessarily going to have to, you're not necessarily have to. This is something that's going to be something where you're going to be able to have it without even needing it, without even wanting it. This is something that's very, very important, because honest to goodness, this is going to be a time for you guys to really start enjoying yourself, just really start having fun, and start really just being able to have everything that you would like. Next card here is a Knight of Swords, saying, honest to goodness, you're going to really be able to, in terms of the third quarter of the month, have the mindset that's really going to move you forward, but at the same time, have everything else that's really going to move you forward as well. Feel great, feel wonderful, and feel like everything is going your way. Because honest to goodness, in terms of Nine of Swords here, it is all going your way. And it's going to make you feel way better than you may actually realize. This, this, this card here is Justice, saying honest to goodness, balance is going to be involved in terms of this quarter. And it's going to be balance of the mind, bal uh, balance of where you're going, and just balance overall. Have fun with this situation, because honest to goodness, balance is all about this situation, and being able to really feel like everything is okay, so you can really move forward with the best intentions and with the best feelings. Next card here is faith in the uh, in, in, in the in the upside down or in the reverse position, saying honest to goodness, in terms of this situation here, you're not really going to have to have so much faith into what's going on in the fourth quarter month because it's just going to show up. It's going to show it to you, and you're really going to be able to realize something that's very very important, very very happy, and just very very great overall. It's going to be wonderful for you. And honest to goodness, in terms of faith, feel great, feel good, and feel like you should. Okay. This card here is a Nine of Swords because, honest to goodness, this situation has been on your mind for quite some time. And whenever it finally sort of kind of comes it comes to fruition, you're really going to be able to feel amazing, feel great, and feel like everything is honest to goodness planned out just so that you could be able to experience happiness, experience growth, and experience this well-being and state of mind, being able to finally relax, being able to feel like things are honest to goodness going your way, and just being able to feel happy overall, okay? So anyways, <laughs> I'm Chris Vatic here, and I'll also do private readings. I can do $75 for a 60-minute Skype session reading, $50 for a 30-minute Skype session reading, or $35 for a private YouTube session for kind of just like this, but for your specific need or issue. I'm also running a sale this month. You can contact me at chrisinvatic at yahoo.com or chrisinvatic.com. Um, anyways, thank you guys so, so much for this video and for all of your likes and your comments and your shares and subscribes, okay? Thank you guys so, so much. I hope you guys have an amazing October, okay? Bye.